the best durian chocolate chips bahulu that you must try out. A day before, dry fry 170 grams of plain flour until it is light and you can see it flying. Use the lowest heat to avoid burning the flour. Leave it to cool overnight. For the batter, you will need 5 eggs and add in 1 eighth of a teaspoon of salt. Beat at the highest speed using the hand mixer. You should beat them until they are fluffy. Then add in 150 grams of caster sugar. Continue beating but on medium speed until the batter is thick and pale. This is our pure durian extract powder. Just use 1 tablespoon of durian extract powder which is equivalent to 10 grams of the pure extract powder. Use hot water to dissolve the extract powder to turn it into a thick paste. Then add in the paste into the batter. Add in 3 tablespoons of ice cream soda. Then sift in the dry fried flour. By using the lower speed, beat until the flour is well incorporated into the batter. Pour the batter into a smaller container, then transfer it into a single nozzle tube. This is the aluminium mold which is not coated with anything, therefore it will stain after usage. Do not wash it with dish detergent. Heat up the mold before using on high heat. Brush every compartment with oil. Use this pair of tongs to hold the kitchen towel to soak up the puddle of oil. Test with water whether the mold is hot enough to start your baking on stove. When the water sizzles, it means that the mold is ready. Pour in the batter till half full. Add half a teaspoon of chocolate chips and then top up the batter until it's almost full. Cover and set the timer for 4 minutes. As the mold is hot enough and well greased, you can easily get the mini sponge cakes out of the mold. Now let's look at why there's difference in the browning. This is slightly brown because when greasing the mold, the oil is not heated up properly yet batter has been poured in. While this is too brown but yet still uneven, this is when the oil is too hot but it shows the outline of the design nicely. This is evenly brown. For the first few rounds, grease the mold but after that you may actually stop greasing the mold. Just continue with pouring the batter in. Try it out yourself. This recipe yields 34 pieces of medium sized goldfish. Head on to our website to get your supplies. Thank you for shopping with Niklo Gourmet.